Today is the Ruby Bridges Walk to School Day. It's honoring Ruby Bridges' courageous walk to school on November 14th in 1960 when she was the first African-American student to join her elementary school in New Orleans, Louisiana. It was a beautiful day here at Lowry and every one of our students participated. Teachers took out their classrooms for their own 10 minute walk along the exterior of our campus and then right back through the front of the school so that students could engage in a symbolic walk to help commemorate this very historic Day. Students from Meridian Creek met up somewhere on the way to school and we walked about a 10 to 15 minute walk in the brisk cold a celebration of her journey and just time to be together as a community. Here at Lowry our students started learning about Ruby Bridges last week and then along with resources from Ruby Bridges Foundation such as discussion questions and a letter to walkers from Ruby Bridges our students K through 5 here at Lowry started learning about who Ruby Bridges was and her historic actions when she started integrating schools. We had a chance last week to talk about it a little bit. We showed a video in advising kind of explaining what it was and I had a chance to go around the classrooms and invite students to participate in the walk and I was really pleased with the turnout that we had. It wasn't that long ago that the events what led to Ruby Bridges starting second grade and what was a white-only school occurred. So I think for a lot of our students, it helps put into perspective the history of our educational system in the United States. It helps them also understand how important acts of bravery and courage even done by a second grader can help to change the wider world. Ruby Bridges' message of taking one step at a time towards ending bullying, ending racism, and a message of spreading kindness to others is really but what the walk today was all about.